Hey everyone, Creative Venus here and welcome to another beautiful tutorial and today we will create this beautiful agenda slide and as you can see it has a very beautiful animation as well. So let's start. So here is a, our blank presentation slide. First of all we will insert a text box and write our agenda like our first slide would be of objectives then the next slide will talk about high level processes then third slide is like our approach and we are duplicating all these text box to create agenda items so these items are just dummy text and you can replace these items as per the requirements of your slide design so like I have written target then comes the budget so budget is our last slide so this becomes the agenda of a slide let's increase the character spacing change the font to Oswald light and we will increase the character spacing by eight points now this font looks big let's reduce it and we have make it 12 now go to align align left and you have to align it vertically as well that is called distribute vertically and this option is present in uh, this option is present under format menu and then you have to click align and there you will find that option so now our agenda is ready and we have to purify it for that you have to select all these items and group them together to group them you have to press ctrl G I have changed the font to Oswald from Oswald light and now it's the time to fill some color into this text for that you have to go to format then go to text options select gradient and remove this gradient stop so we will create a full gradient stop and and you can fill any color you want so I have filled like the combination of yellow orange red and purple and some blue as well so you can insert the gradient stops and create your own gradients so now I have change the gradient angle diagonally and now the text is filled with gradient color and and you can arrange them and position them in the middle I have again changed the font of the text to Oswald light now we will write agenda and select the first letter of the word agenda A and increase its size now select the word agenda and change the font to agency FP and increase the size now again select A and change the font to impact and increase the size and further increase the size now it looks much better go to format go to align align to the middle now go to home further increase the size so it's totally up to you you can decide what size you want what font looks good to you and now we will insert a rectangle shape and place it at the end and let's place it here so that it doesn't overlap the rectangle shape the white colored rectangle shape that we have just inserted now again pick a rectangle shape and we will create a gradient 
bar here and align to the middle and fill the same gradient color that we have filled in the agenda items now let's place this gradient bar in the middle select agenda and apply the same gradient color change angle and apply the shadow effect change the shadow parameters as per your choice also change the shadow color from black to light gray or dark gray the space between the agenda items is too much let's reduce it further so I have removed some of the empty space and now the agenda items are looking much better so what else we can do here let's change the font of the GENDA to Oswald and it is looking better now and more beautiful now now we will cover the animation part so I'm just trying to figure out if italic looks good here but no I'm just experimenting few things if it works we will keep it otherwise we will undo this effect and font size so our slide is almost ready and one last step is insert a rectangle shape and place it on the left and fill white color in this rectangle and you must be thinking why I've inserted these white colored rectangles on both left and right side of the slide as these are not visible but these will be helpful for animations well animation part is very easy first select the agenda go to animation click on fly in press start with previous duration 1.25 and delay by 0 0.50 and your animation is ready for the agenda text now the next step is select the vertical bar and apply flat float in transition animation now let's ungroup all these agenda items and for that you have to right click and group then press ungroup now select the fly in animation and select start with previous increase the duration you can increase it to 1.25 and also increase the delay and select the effect options from left to right now what I'm doing is on each agenda item I'm increasing a delay I'm adding some delay between each agenda item as you can see you can add 0.25 or 0 0.50 between each animation so this will give a very nice effect our slide design is complete and this is a very beautiful neat minimal kind of business presentation slide and if you like this design please hit the like button subscribe to our channel hit the bell icon and share your thoughts in the comment section below this will motivate us and we will bring out more such stuff to you so you can watch this tutorial learn it and download this template from the link given in the video description it's a g drive link so that's it for now and keep watching our tutorials bye bye peace